This is year four subtraction. Just like the addition, we'll start by putting the place value columns above the digits. I've got my units, my tens, hundreds, units, tens, hundreds. And again, this is just to reinforce the children's understanding of the value of each digit and to make sure that they line up their calculation. So I'm going to do my calculation. So I've got seven units, six tens, and five hundreds. Nine units, two tens, and three hundreds. I'm going to put my operation sign, so it's subtract. And unlike addition, we explain to the children that subtraction is not commutative, so it's the opposite. We can't put the numbers either way. The biggest number always has to go on top. And that's a really important skill for, for what they need to remember. So now we've set our calculation up, we can, do, we can begin with the units. And we begin by doing seven, take away nine. Now what I usually say to the children, if I have seven sweets or seven pencils, can you take nine from me? And that really helps them understand. So seven take away nine, you can't do that. So we have to go next door to the tens column. There are six lots of tens in this column. And what we're going to do is we're going to take one lot of 10. If we take one lot of 10, what would it become? So it becomes five lots of 10 or 50. And I add that 10 to my units column. I then ask, what does this number become? Well, it becomes 17. Can we now do the calculation? 17 take away nine? Yes, we can. So 17 take away nine is eight. And again, we can put them at the side just at the beginning to make sure they understand the value of each digit. Well, I've got eight units. It needs to belong with the units family. So I put it underneath the units. I can then move on to my tens column. I've got 50 take away 20. Well, 50 take away 20 is 30. Again, just to make sure that they understand the value. Well, how many tens have I got left? I've got three lots of 10 or 30. And I put that underneath the tens. And now finally, I can do my hundreds column. So I've got 500 take away 300. 500 take away 300 is 200. So I can put my 200s into the hundreds column. So 567 take away 329 equals 238.